Hello everyone, welcome to my channel, The Bold and the Beautiful Bank. Everyone is having a wonderful day. Before starting the video, please subscribe and keep watching for more details videos. Bold and Beautiful Preview Deacon ponders the impossible about Sheila, and Luna cracks under pressure. In the latest The Bold and the Beautiful Preview for April 8-12, who just got burned to a crisp? Read on and watch the preview below. Brace yourselves for the ultimate soap crossover event. Last week, Deacon arranged a memorial service to say goodbye to Sheila, which was a bone of contention for many. Hope was torn whether or not to go to support her dad, but she did. Steffi couldn't believe Finn would go say goodbye to the woman who tried to kill them, but he did as well, and used the opportunity to try and push Hope into taking back Liam. That would solve some of his problems with Liam budding into his marriage. However, it was the final moments of the week that sent viewers into a tizzy. Deacon said a final goodbye to Sheila at the crematorium, even once again lifting the sheet on her face to see her one last time. He then pushed the button to fire up the furnace and started Sheila's body rolling towards the flames. As it tipped to go in, the sheet slipped revealing Sheila's feet and ten toes. Deacon raced to stop the cremation, but it seemed it was too late. Coming up, Deacon says, Finn, they had ten toes. What if she's alive? If Sheila is alive, then who did Steffi kill, and who was just cremated? With Thomas taking off to Paris, RJ already floated the idea to Zend and Luna they'll need to step up to help with the hope for the future line. Next week, Hope tells Luna she would really love it if she could work closely with Zend. I'm sure he has plenty of secrets to share. This clearly pushes Luna to her breaking point, as if she wasn't already there. Coming up, RG asks, Luna, did something happen after the party? Luna cries. Will she finally tell him what mommy's special mints led to that night? Read the bold and beautiful spoilers to find out what Finn thinks is going on with Deacon. Before you go, check out our gallery of Soap's worst couples of all time. Bold and Beautiful's Brooke is stepping into a nightmare, of her own making. Everybody knows the Romeo and Juliet effect, right? The more you try to keep a couple apart, the greater the individual's attraction to one another will be. Well, we're gonna go out on a limb and wager that bold and beautiful busybody Brooke doesn't know the Romeo and Juliet effect. So when she gets an eyeful of Hope and Thomas modeling the latest in bedsheets in the July 13 episode, she's going to do the exact wrong thing. Bonkers Bold and Beautiful Reveal Shayla Trial Shocker Leaves, Spoiler, Bushwhacked by Betrayal In the glittering world of the bold and the beautiful, where passion, betrayal, and high fashion collide, Brooke Logan Forrester is a force to be reckoned with. As one of the show's most iconic characters, Brooke has weathered her fair share of storms over the years, from tumultuous love affairs to bitter family feuds. But now, as she finds herself stepping into a nightmare of her own making, Brooke must confront the consequences of her actions in a way she never imagined. For Brooke, the nightmare begins when a long-buried secret from her past comes back to haunt her. As the truth threatens to unravel her carefully constructed life, Brooke is forced to confront the fallout of her choices and the damage they have caused to those she holds dear. As the drama unfolds, Brooke's loved ones are left reeling, grappling with the shock of her betrayal and struggling to come to terms with the reality of who she truly is. From her husband Ridge Forrester to her children and beyond, Brooke's deception shakes the very foundation of their relationships, leaving them questioning everything Brooke, they thought the they nightmare is far from over. As she faces the consequences of her actions, she must also reckon with the guilt and shame that threaten to consume her. With her reputation hanging in the balance and her relationships in jeopardy, Brooke is forced to confront the darkest parts of herself and reckon with the choices that led her to this moment. As the walls close in around her, Brooke is left with a choice. Will she continue to cling to her secrets and lies, or will she finally come clean and face the truth head-on? With the stakes higher than ever, Brooke must summon all of her strength and courage to confront the nightmare she has created and find a way to set things right before it's too late. But as Brooke soon discovers, the path to redemption is not an easy one. With old enemies resurfacing and new obstacles standing in her way, Brooke must navigate treacherous waters if she hopes to find her way back to the light. And as she confronts the ghosts of her past and confronts the demons within, 
Burke will learn that sometimes the only way out of a nightmare is to face it head-on and emerge stronger on the other side. As the dust settles and the nightmare begins to fade, Brooke will emerge from the darkness forever changed. But with her loved ones by her side and her spirit unbroken, she will prove that even in the face of her own worst nightmares, she is still the bold and beautiful woman she has always been. Big mistake. Table for one. In other words, Brooke is going to freak, then move heaven and earth to ensure that her daughter steer clear of her new lover boy. As a result, a fancy that might have been just passing will develop into a full-blown relationship. You can't tell me what to do. We can already hear Hope saying, You're not my mother. I mean fine, you are my mother, she'll have to correct herself. But that still doesn't give you any right to boss me around. You and me against the world. As Brooke reels from the horror of Hope's romance with the Stepson she's never much liked, except when on Blackberries, the fledgling couple will form a united front. Brooke can say whatever she wants, she can do whatever she wants, but they are together, they reassure one another, and that's the way they are going to stay. Just when Brooke thinks that things can't get any worse, the fates are like, hold my beer. Ridge's destiny rails against Thope so feverishly that eventually, Thomas' dad is like, take it down a notch. He's sane right now and they're happy, chill. Which is of course not something that Brooke will be able to do. And as she badmouths Thomas up one side of L.A. and down the other, she sets herself up for Taylor to issue the ultimate, I told ye so, by driving Ridge away. Where will that leave, Brooke? Her daughter's hooking up with a man that she considers dangerously unstable, and the husband she can't quite quit is on the verge of quitting her. And she has no one to blame but herself. Review Brooke's long and storied history in the below photo gallery. Come back to our channel for all your updates. Thank you for watching.